There you go, all hot and ready. They call these their siloglog meals. Dalawang itlog, so two eggs instead of the usual one that you will get for any of your silog meals. And I absolutely think that it is an ingenious way for Eatwell to stand out without trying too hard. Meat is uh, pretty lean too. So there you have it. Siloglog meals by Eat Well. It's getting hot here. Kaya lipat muna tayo. Don't forget, eat well every day. So, uh, I don't really have anything else that's red to make that transition work. But you know what? I have an idea. There you go. So, live streaming is as straightforward as it gets. Basically, you pick up a device that can connect to the internet as well as capture video and audio, usually in cell phone mode, and you're good to go. But if you're looking to live stream for several hours at a time regularly, you may benefit from a pre-stream routine to get yourself equally prepared each time you go live. And I'm talking about a checklist. At its most basic purpose, having a checklist helps because it ensures consistency in carrying out the task. Para sa akin, it also saves time in trying to figure out kung kompleto na ba yung setup or kung may nakalimutan pa ako. Minsan kapag may pressure dahil nagmamadali, I can't help but find myself going back and forth between different places of the house and the stream room kasi pa isa-isa ko lang naaalala yung mga items na kailangan ko. Having a checklist is better than eyeballing everything, starting the stream, and then only to find out na may nakalimutan ako. And ngayon naman, para sa mga nanonood ng stream ko, Feel ko may tanong kayo sa akin. Okay, Carlos, so why do you still forget things during your stream? Fair enough. And the answer is that I'm just about to start my own checklist after this video. To be completely honest, this is the reason why I actually thought of creating this video in the first place. I just realized that having a checklist will solve so many of my problems. So if you do watch my live stream, beginning this week. Mapapansin nyo na di na ako mawawala sa stream kasi more or less andun na yung mga gamit na kailangan ko para sa stream. Number one, water. You're going to be talking for the next hour or so. Water is going to be your friend. Makakatulong to sa bosses mo whether or not you sing and it will hydrate you. And even if you have to go to the bathroom because of it, it's probably one of the few excusable things that you can do live. And because I'm not particular with the temperature of my water, mas gusto kong malamig throughout. That's why I recommend you get yourself a double wall tumbler. I use this, which I think is going to be super useful. It's like magic kasi buong stream mo malamig laman ang water jug mo. So yes, drink your water, b****. Next up, internet connection. Water is to human life as internet connectivity is to live streamer life. Huh? You get it? Kung malapit na ang stream mo at napansin mo na naghihingalo ang internet mo, huwag ka nang magdalawang isip. I-restart mo na ang router mo. Just don't forget to ask for permission from other people in your household to do so. The worst thing that could happen is may nag ml or may nag-COD. Huwag na natin pansinin yung mga nag-zoom. Sa bahay ninyo, tapos rank match pala yun, biglang sabay na walang sila ng internet. GG ka sa kanila. This next one is an age-old tip. Soothe your eyes pre-stream. If kagigising mo lang at puffy pa rin ang mata mo, o buong araw ka nang busy at pagod na ang itsura ng mata mo, place the back of two really cold spoons under your eyes and sweep them gently to give your eyes a refresher. It works every time. Freeze mo lang yung spoons mo prior. 30 minutes to an hour in the freezer should be cold enough. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Hala, basa. Masyada yata akong nag -e enjoy Sweep them throughout. 
any better. <laughs> of course, uh, it looks much better than this. Hindi lang ako handa. Literal, dinukot ko lang to galing sa freezer. Uh, wala pa tayong towel. Number four, lights. This one is pretty simple. Just make sure your lights are set up the way they should be. Placement, direction. Also make sure na nakaplug sila if they go by wall sockets or make sure na full battery if they go by that. Speaking of charge, number five, don't forget your chargers and cables for all the gear you're using. It's one thing to make sure that all your devices are charged before the stream. Pero kung nagkataon na hindi sila fully charged and wala na ring oras, you wouldn't want your devices dying on you midstream. It's happened to me way too many times and di ako proud. Power bank is number six. Sometimes when life conspires against you, you pretty much have all your devices charging at the same time. And this leaves you with no available socket to plug other devices that you may need to get power from. So true to its purpose, having a power bank is your backup. I suggest a power bank with at least two slots para sagad ang use. And by the way, if you're wondering, I'll be putting a link of all the stuff I'm using in the description box just in case gusto niyo malaman kung ano yung items na ginagamit ko. Next, paper towels. I don't think there is just a single need for paper towels. You can use them to maintain your stream area. Just make sure to be mindful in their use para save the earth tayo. And pro tip, if because of urgency, pinampunas mo lang yung paper towels mo sa let's say natabig na tubig, reuse them eventually for whatever that needs wet wiping. Wag lang siguro sa mukha mo, no Carlos? Nearing the end at number 8, background music. Easily one of the most impactful ways to elevate your stream, gumamit ka ng background music. Go ahead with whatever music you want, basta lang sumunod ka sa rules ng live stream platform mo. Minsan kasi bawal ang copyright music, kaya kailangan maghanap ng copyright free songs. Be creative and build a playlist according to what you think everyone in the stream will have fun with. And last but definitely not the least, a sitting aid! Napakatito ba? But let's get real here. Na experience yun na ba na sumakit lower back nyo after long periods of sitting? Totally normal. It's not because you're unfit. A lot of healthy and active people actually experience the same pain too kapag masyado nang matagal nakaupo. When you sit on most chairs, you're actually putting your pelvis in an awkward position which ends up with your lower back compensating for your weight. Having a sitting aid, just like this one, will actually fix these problems so that you can sit forever. Science, the more you know. Like we said in the beginning, live streaming can be super straightforward. So you may not even need a checklist depending on your style. But if you think a checklist is something that you can benefit from, then it's definitely one of those simple things that you can do that can have a positive impact on your workflow. Your checklist can also be very different from mine depending on your setup. Some of you may have complicated setups that include other equipment in the checklist while some are good with just a full charge of their phone and a glass of water in front of them. Personally, kung saan saan ako sa bahay nag-stream, kaya palipat-lipat din yung gamit ko. In a situation like mine, for sure nakakatulong ang checklist. Anyway, let's go out for a while. This entire time, hirap na hirap tayo magsalita. But I hope you understood a lot of that. There's a lot of useful information that you can definitely use for yourself for your live stream. Sa ngayon, kailangan lang talaga muna natin lumabas at magpaaraw. And here we are now, pleasant change of scenery. Para naman maiba, um, I think the past few outros for our live stream tutorials have been filmed just in my room. I want to introduce you to somebody. Bow Bow. Hi Bow Bow. Hi Bow Bow. So, this my friends is Bow Bow. And Bow Bow is a very good dog. Are you a good dog, Bao Bao? Are you a good dog, Bao Bao? Yes, he says yes. Anyway, that is all that... Oh, Bao Bao's still here. Look at Bao Bao. 
that is all that we have for today. I'll see you guys next time. If you like this video, if you think you learned a lot, or if you think marami kang magagamit in your future live streams, please give this video a like or a thumbs up. Um, subscribe to the channel and uh, hit the notification bell para mas updated ka parate. As always, no pressure in doing that or in doing those things. But super appreciate it if you do. It'll definitely help the channel grow. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.